On the eve of the first anniversary of Hamas's October 7 attack on Israel, the country continued its barrage on Gaza. Dozens were killed and wounded when Israeli airstrikes hit a mosque and a school sheltering displaced people in the enclave early on Sunday. That's according to the Hamas-run Gaza government media office. The Israeli military called the attack precise strikes on Hamas terrorists who were operating embedded in the school and mosque in the Deir al-Bala area in central Gaza, a claim Hamas rejects. Palestinian health officials said at least another 20 people had been killed since Saturday night in northern Gaza after the Israeli army sent tanks into the area for the first time in months and urged residents to leave. Hamas attacked southern Israel on October 7, 2023, killing 1,200 people and taking about 250 hostages, according to Israeli tallies. Israel's subsequent military assault on Gaza has killed nearly 42,000 Palestinians, according to Gaza's health ministry. It has also displaced nearly all of the enclave's 2.3 million people, caused a hunger crisis and led to genocide allegations at the world court that Israel denies. Israel also battered Beirut's southern suburbs overnight through Sunday morning. It's the most intense bombardment of the Lebanese capital since Israel sharply escalated its campaign against Iran-backed group Hezbollah last month. Israel said its air force had conducted a series of targeted strikes on weapons storage facilities and Hezbollah terrorist infrastructure sites. Lebanese authorities did not immediately say what the missiles had hit or what damage they caused. In almost a year of fighting between Hezbollah and Israel, more than 2,000 people have been killed in Lebanon, most of them in the past two weeks, according to its health ministry.